of four sports right here on TV3 New Day. And it looks like things are just had all across board in our dear country, Ghana. It's not just petrol prices that are hitting 10 cities by tomorrow, but the Cape Coast pitch is also not ready for our clash. The World Cup qualifiers between Ghana and Nigeria slated for 25th. It looks like we are not ready because the Nigerians have made a formal complaint to CAF that it doesn't look like they would be able to play that match on our pitch. That looks very deplorable right now after the Sith match celebrations held on that same pitch. Why? I have no idea. But Yaofo Sulabi is here with all the details. Good morning, Kawawa. Morning, how are you doing? Good to see you. Good to see you too. Listen, mm -hmm. I don't know how to describe this whole thing, but isn't it pathetic that for a first leg to be held here mm -hmm. in our home, yeah. we are not ready? Yeah. Why we gave out the Cape Coast Stadium mm -hmm. for the Sith March celebrations, yep. I do not understand. Yes, of course, I understand that President Anado made a promise some time ago during campaign mm -hmm. that yes, henceforth or sometime in the future, the um, Independence Day celebrations will be held there. So we decided to hold the 65th one there. But why get the pitch to this state mm -hmm. that now the Nigerians are saying to Cuff that we would not be able to use this. Now it looks like Babayara may have to suffice, but if it doesn't, then we'd have to go to neighboring Morocco or Benin. Such a shame. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I, I think you've, you've, you've described my, everything. My, my ex yeah, yeah, just no, said, you've, no. yeah you've, you've said no, everything. but such a shame But, but I, think, I think that we, we hurt ourselves in many ways. One, one of which was the anniversary celebrations. And, and the thing is, just after the anniversary celebrations, what we could have done was we could have just tried to get the pitch in shape without posting pictures of the bad pitch on social media. So why do, so who but posted it? it was, was it the, the NSA? The NSA themselves. They posted They were trying to justify that they, they could get, um, it, get ready. it ready by 25th. And so they, they just kept posting pictures of the pitch Tell it, but three um, weeks, uh, on social media. Three weeks and, to get that. I and, mean, and, and, it's been less than three weeks, like 18 days yep. to get that pitch ready for such an international match. Yeah. I think it's a no-no. Yeah. It's a no-no. We so, probably so could I have... mean, for, for those who are wondering, 25th is not that far away. It's just next week, next week Friday. That's 25th. So, so if you think 25th is far away, it's not. It's just next week Friday. The Nigerians so, are getting ready. And so, yeah. They are out with their squad, mm -hmm. names of their squad members yeah. for that game already. We are still dilly dally, and I've seen a few names yeah. out there. Yeah. But we are not even sure exactly what we are going to do. Yep. And a pitch to play that match has become a problem. Yeah. Are you serious? And, and it's, um, uh, we're just hoping that Kumasi will be approved by, by CAF. But if it's not, like you rightly mentioned, we're hearing rumors that we the, have game to could, go to Benin. the game could could go to Benin or, or to Morocco. Morocco, but I mean, if it goes to Benin, that, that would that would technically be the home of the Nigerians because Benin share a border with Nigeria, with Nigeria. and they will just troop in and support their team. I think they will be more in the stadium than than we would. This is terrible. And so and so, um, let's just hope that you know Kumasi is selected. But before we get into the the story proper into Kumasi, let's just go to Cape Coast and check out what uh, the pitch looks like, mm. what a report from from Cape Coast has been. Uh, so far about the state of the Cape Coast Stadium ahead of next week's Friday's game. For the 2022 FIFA World Cup qualifier between Ghana and Nigeria is still uncertain as the Cape Coast Sports Stadium is facing rejection. Officials from the Ghana Football Association, the National Sports Authority and CAF earlier today visited the venue to inspect it for the final time ahead of the final showdown. But then the media were not allowed access to the stadium. Many attempts have been made to speak to officials after the inspection. We spoke to some of the fans and they had this to say. Hearing that they are going to move the location to Ashanti region had actually affected so many people, particularly even to our business. We, because we have made plans to order so many products so that we can sell our kebab and sausages. I know they can best remove there. Mom, 
nti ka ba sere re ka omo bo made se o bo tumi aye no ma se de omo ye ne na ka ma che na abaso wa ase no de kepo stan ka sa no nsha da anya shi obebre it is time i hear your word am lying you di so where your games am wo bo ma che na ze wa ha na hen so ye nya eh kakra yen yen eh seu su ko sure kakra jim ti so ban de activities in ha ti yen su kakra e be nya anyi football na ze ya was baba he ti so e dem ze oba ha o hen pa so am fam ba Right, so that's the uh, report by my colleague Francis Hema uh, in Cape Coast. Yeah. Morocco. Exactly. I mean, it's uh, no, but I understand the applies. So it's very. Oh, disheartening this is disheartening. Um, if you know that a game is coming to your city, you get I mean, ready you get for ready it. For yes. the game. And, and and so the vendors have. And been... this is just no game, you know. It's exactly. Ghana, Nigeria, Nigeria. World Cup qualifiers yeah. every day. It's a big one. But let's hear from um, Executive Council member of the Ghana Football Association, Freda Champong, who's been. Also speaking about the state of the Cape Coast pitch and whether the Babaya Stadium will be ready for that game. Under the, the regulation, we have what we call emergency license. That emergency license is granted under extraordinary circumstances, which I believe the situation at the Cape Coast Stadium or the situation Ghana finds itself in may, may fall under. And so when it is that the commercial stadium is um, ready, approved, or the inspector now files satisfactory report then if there is any situation arising out of the situation we have at kipu stadium then the command stadium can just come in as emergency situation in this circumstance if none of our stream now passes then the choice will be with the organizers to nominate stadium for you of course they take a lot of things into consideration points if you are playing against in nigeria they can't take you to nigeria when it is that the other um, approved or licenses um venues around you know uh, they would choose for you, you would not choose but obviously they take a lot of things into consideration uh, in choosing uh, these venues and so that's what happens but uh, i mean the information we have from the nsa is that they are working tirelessly working very very hard around the clock to get the pitch ready by the 18 so okay. we have like four or five days now let's see what happens with that and i believe that they should be able to do some work. Um, notwithstanding that, I think that the commercial stadium is also now um, in shape. Uh, we've seen the playing surface, we've seen the facilities at the commercial stadium. So let's see what comes about it. But I'm very, very hopeful. I'm very optimistic that uh, the game should happen here in Ghana, either at the Cape Coast Stadium or the commercial stadium. I, I, I pray that it happens that way. Right, so that was uh, for the champion there, mm. Cookie. But so if that's... if if I am Ghanaian, I'm mm -hmm. just saying if because I'm not sure who I am right now. Mm -hmm. But if I'm Ghanaian, if a Ghanaian man is speaking, no, say four or five days, mm -hmm. he's not sure. Yeah. Because when we are sure, so in five days he'll be ready. Yeah. But you know, it's like two, two, thirty, three, four. Mm -hmm. You understand? He says four or five days. I'm not sure. Babayara can be ready now. Even if it can be ready, you just hinted that the Nigerians would not love it. Oh no, but they don't have a say in this. I mean, if, yeah. if Kaf approves Kumasi, they, they don't should have play a, at yeah, Babayara. Have a say in this. But then Babayara will give us a plus, though. Yeah. I mean, that's Kumasi. Yeah, that's Kumasi. Massive, massive we, support we, we hardly lose for the Kumasi. Black Stars. We hardly, hardly. Yeah, we hardly lose know. Lose. <laughs> <laughs> no, but but th this is such a shame. I mean, after 65 years of independence, this shouldn't be what we should be going through as a country. No, but, not but, having a qualified pitch. No, but Cookie, you know that, you know, um, if it wasn't for the Independence Day celebrations, that Cape Coast pitch would have been ready. Was it by force? Yeah, exactly. Did I mean, so, so... Did we have so, to? So, so, we're sitting um, in this country, when sports analysts were complaining, was it in December, when there was a, a concert held at the... At the Crossport Stadium. Yeah. Stadium. And that's what was supposed to do something. It was... Uh, um, there were league games that were supposed to be Exactly. So then, couldn't yeah. we learn our lesson from that? We could have learned our lesson and then we went all the way now to go and destroy the pitch and now we don't even have a pitch. But anyway, maybe Babayara will suffice. If it doesn't, then we'd have to travel all the way. But you see, Yebeboka, Yebeboka mm -hmm. meaning exactly. hotels have been yes, booked. So yes. many things have been yes, done. Yes. Even government is yes. going to incur a lot of costs. Exactly. So Babayara, oh, it, it has to happen. If Babayara doesn't happen, then they'll have to come and account for the money because, Charlie, to go to... Listen, we have to book flights, hotels. Oh, Sereme. <laughs> 
Come on, it's not serious. <laughs> no, I like how, I like like, how passionate exactly, you are Exactly, because this. too many things are going no, wrong no, in but, the country. No, but I'm, I'm optimistic that it, Baba would, would. You think it, so? Yeah, it would. But it, that pitch, though, it's, it's, no, it's, it's, it's way it's, better. It's, no, it's in good shape, yeah. yeah. It's in good shape. I mean, Kotoko, Kotoko Kim Faisal have played their games mm -hmm. there um, over the past two, three months. Mm -hmm. and so, yeah, I mean, uh, the, the Kumasi Stadium mm -hmm. is, is, is okay. Anyway. And, and yeah, it, All it, right. it the game. Uh, so we'll, we'll, we'll just pull the brakes on that one mm -hmm. and see what happens in the coming days. I'm yep. sure by Friday we'll have some yes. good news yes. as to whether yes. Babayara is, is the substituted mm -hmm. um, stadium for, for, for that match.